morning, Alatuna. I'm Caroline Martin, and you're watching The Anchor Live. It's Wednesday, October 2nd. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and pause for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. While many of us left town for fall break, a few stayed behind and represented Alatuna here at home. Let's go check out some Anchor Sports. Good morning, campers. I'm Ethan Shepard, and today's sports segment is all about volleyball. Our varsity ladies played Creekview and South Cobb in their last two games of the season. The result? No surprise here. The ladies shut out both teams in straight sets. Complete domination. Our squad now marches into the postseason with their region tournament this Saturday. They'll begin their tourney run in an early 8 a.m. match against Campbell. If you're like me, you'll be grabbing some early morning arts bagels before heading to the match, not game, match, to support these ladies. Go Bucks! And as for football, this Friday, we take on Sprayberry for our homecoming matchup. It's a blackout, so make sure you're there and you are loud! And that'll do it for your sports report. Caroline, back to you. Thanks, Ethan. We'll be right back after this. RTC is in simplest form a leadership development program. For the most part, you're always improving or finding something that makes everything a little bit more meaningful. It's just a big family. We get to know each other really well through the, through the years we have together. The main reason for shooting with ROTC is it has a lot of scholarship opportunities, mentoring opportunities, a lot of opportunities to learn, grow, a citizen. Uh, we do a lot of community service events. We have some every single week. I know uh, just this past Saturday we had a Kennesaw Mountain Trail cleanup, so we go out and we help the people, uh, you know, build the trails or rebuild the trails or whatever they need help with. That's what we do, and we do a lot of stuff with uh, different churches around the community, elderly homes, stuff like that. If you're interested in ROTC even a little bit, I would recommend you try it at least for a semester or two because you never know it could be become your future or it could just lead to you becoming better. I'm Cadet Ingram. My name is Daniel Heisa. My name is Kyle Slater. We are ROTC Cadets. Welcome back. Now for some morning announcements. In honor of Hispanic Heritage Month, the Diversity Club is hosting a salsa dancing lesson and Celebration Day today after school in room 2401. We hope to see you there. Skills USA will meet tomorrow morning in room 1406. Be prepared for games and prizes. Our FCC LA Club is hosting a trunk or treat on October 31st from 530 to 7. If your club would like to participate in this community event, please contact Ms. Alejandro for some, as soon as possible. Let's uh, lots going on this homecoming week, so let's hear about it with Aiden in our Helm Half Minute. Homecoming tickets are on sale all this week. 
Just go to the helm desk during your lunch. Single tickets are $35 and date tickets are $50. If you're a book pass holder, you get a discount. Just present your student ID with the book pass hologram to receive your $5 discount. If you'd rather pay online, just go to mypaymentsplus.com. See Coach Duro with any questions. We can't wait to see you dressed up today as your celebrity twin, whether it's a character they've played or just them on a regular day. Thursday is a day in Paris. Dress up as anything French themed. Grab your baguette and enjoy your trip to homecoming. Friday is grade level day. Seniors should wear black, juniors wear red, sophomores wear gray, and freshmen wear white. Our game theme on October 4th is a blackout, so come out and show your buck pride. Check with us tomorrow with more HOKO news. Caroline, back to you. Thanks, Aiden. The student of the day is Emmy Williams. Emmy is a hardworking student who engages herself fully in all she does. Her teachers say they especially appreciate how she stops by to check if they need any help. Great job. Please go up to the front office during your lunch to receive your award. And that's all we have for today, Alatuna. Check back again tomorrow morning for more. Thanks for watching and have a smooth sailing day.